Welcome to the fascinating world of Qingling pandas, also known as brown pandas. These adorable animals are one of the rarest species of pandas in the world. Join us to discover more about their history, natural habitat, and incredible curiosities that make them such a special species. Hello friends! Welcome to another video. I would like to thank everyone for watching and ask that, if you like what you see, please hit the like button and subscribe on the channel. I will be bringing you lots of interesting and useful content, so make sure to turn on notifications so you don't miss any updates. Thanks for following me on this journey that I am creating with lots of love. Let's go to the video. The Qingling Panda, Ailuropoda melanolucta kinlingensis, also known as the Qingling Giant Panda, is a subspecies of the giant panda, Ailuropoda melanolucca, that is native to the Qingling Mountains in China. Qingling pandas are distinguished from other giant panda subspecies by their smaller size, lighter fur color, and longer, thicker fur. They have well-developed, curved claws which help them grasp branches and move through trees. This species is endangered, with fewer than 1,000 individuals remaining in the wild. Qingling pandas have been around for millions of years and were first discovered by scientists in the 19th century. They were scientifically classified as a subspecies of the giant panda and were named in honor of the Qingling Mountains where they are found. They are an important symbol of Chinese culture and have become an international symbol of conservation. They are an endangered species and are listed as vulnerable on the IUCN Red List, International Union for Conservation of Nature. Found in the Qingling Mountains in the province of Shaanxi, China, these mountains are located in the center of China and are home to a diverse array of plants and animals. Qingling pandas are found at altitudes ranging from 1,200 to 2,200 meters and live in bamboo forests. They have a diet that is almost exclusively bamboo and use their powerful jaw muscles and strong teeth to crush and grind the hard stems and leaves of bamboo plants. They can also eat other plants such as fruit and roots when bamboo is not available. They have a thick layer of fat and a thick coat of fur to help them survive the cold temperatures of their mountain habitat. They are solitary animals in the wild but may meet and reproduce when resources are available. Male pandas mark their territory with urine and feces to warn other males, and females typically give birth to one cub at a time. The lifespan is about 20 years in the wild. Medium-sized animals, measuring more than 1 meter and 20 centimeters in length, and weighing between 60 and 70 kilograms. They have paws that measure about 25 centimeters in length and claws that measure about 5 centimeters in length. The Qingling panda faces many challenges in the wild, including habitat loss and fragmentation, illegal hunting, and competition with other species for resources. Climate change is also a threat to the Qingling panda and its habitat, as higher temperatures and altered precipitation patterns can affect the availability of bamboo and other resources. Other threats include disease and conflict with humans. They are a unique subspecies and cannot be replaced by other giant panda subspecies in their habitat. Conservation efforts, including habitat protection and breeding programs, are underway to help protect and increase the population of Qingling pandas. Natural reserves have been created in the Qingling Mountains to protect the pandas' habitat, and controlled breeding programs are being carried out to increase the population. In addition, awareness campaigns and efforts to educate the local population and governments are being carried out to ensure that Qingling pandas have a secure future. The Qingling panda is beloved worldwide and is an important symbol of conservation. 
By continuing to learn more about this unique subspecies and protecting its habitat, we can help ensure that Qingling pandas continue to thrive for a long time to come. Despite the challenges they face, Qingling pandas are a resilient species that has survived for millions of years in their native habitat. By working to understand and address the threats faced by this unique subspecies, we can help ensure that Qingling pandas continue to thrive in the wild for generations. Thank you for watching until the end. I hope you enjoyed the video and learned something useful. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more interesting and useful content like this. Make sure to turn on notifications so you don't miss any updates. Thanks for following me on this journey that I'm creating with lots of love. See you next time.